You get yourself a pretty chain layer. <laughs> Why don't you squeal like a YouTuber? <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome or welcome back to my channel. You already know I truly, truly, truly appreciate you. Wait a minute. That doesn't sound like my intros. I don't even really have intros, what the fuck am I doing? Oh yeah, I'm gonna tell you why that happened. Because today marks a brand new day on this channel. And I'm talking about a great new series I'm starting called YouTuber Tributes. It begins today. I will embark on a quest to pay tribute and give recognition and express my gratitude to some of my favorite YouTubers. Some of these dedicated, admirable women and men I am personally subscribed to. Others will be picked based on YouTube community prowess, contributions to the fans such as comments and shoutouts, etc. Based on hard work, consistency with content and uploads, and uh, entertainment value, logical use of their internet personality, and many more aspects I've used to pick these said YouTubers. You may also leave a comment on a YouTuber you think I should be doing an episode about, and why. If the reason's good enough, of course I'll pin your comment and do an episode on that particular YouTuber you picked. Our very first episode today, paying tribute to an honorable genuine man. He is a veteran of the American military, and I am referring to none other than Devin G. His channel is a reaction channel, he does movies, TV series, YouTube animations like Meat Canyon, he also looks at things like uh, epic rap battles of history and so on and so forth, he does a lot of reactions, it's really cool. Uh, he also has a secondary channel called Devin G Vlogs, it is a wholesome look into this great man's love and rich life, and I would definitely check it out if I were you. His channel is about maybe one of three reaction channels I'll actually watch on YouTube. And uh, the reason is it's pretty simple. Uh, this guy, he's pretty honest. He's down to earth. Seems like a genuine man, you know? And uh, it seems like he is truthfully reacting to these uh, films and shows for the first time. So that definitely makes it more worth it. But for Devin? Well, it seems for Devin reacting to these films gives him a, a, a super euphoric sensation, you know, like when I when I see him having these intense facial expressions, these this gleeful chuckling he has, or heart-wrenching tears, uh, especially when reacting to uh, war-based cinema, uh, it gets me teary-eyed watching him uh, shed tears as well, I'm sure it's the same for most of you who watch him. Um, but, but that's just the thing, you know, uh, especially for a veteran like Devin, uh, Watching those kinds of films probably gives him a, a second-hand experience, uh, a safe and secure second-hand experience to a life once lived. And I'm sure for most soldiers, currently active or retired vets, uh, have a passion for honor, right over wrong, and overcoming the most hellish conditions. And, well, it seems like Devin is just one of those kinds of guys, you know? He uh, seems like he's very dedicated, motivated. Yeah, he does what he needs to do, and he lives his life out day by day. Uh, he's very grateful and happy all the time, you know. And when he's down, he, he knows how to deal with it, it seems. So, uh, he seems like a very stand-up guy. And, you know, I, I'm sure, I'm, I'm not American, I'm Canadian. But it doesn't matter. You serve for your country, man, I respect you. You are a hell of a dude. I've never seen it, surprisingly. So do not judge me, man. But I know for a fact that this movie is absolutely awesome. So I'm a little concerned about watching this. Me being a prior veteran, man, I know for a fact that I just may get choked up from watching this. Because again, me being a prior veteran, man, anytime it comes to army movies and, you know, perseverance and things like that, it is good in my heart. So just in case, you know what I'm saying, I get a little choked up. I got me some tissue, y'all. I got me some tissue. So I may get a little teary-eyed, man. So if I do, don't be judging me. And if you do, I don't give a shit. Because again, man, I love these kind of movies. I love it. Devin, you are truly too humble. <laughs> you are too humble, man. Prior veteran? No, you're always a veteran, my friend. You're always going to be a hero to the day you die. You know that? 
So don't put yourself down, and if people don't like it, well, they can just go fuck themselves now, can't they? <laughs> and, you know, you, you shouldn't have to apologize, man. That's that's a natural reaction, you know, and I'll be right there getting teary-eyed with you, buddy. Don't you worry. But this is truly one of the many reasons that Devin G's channel is only about one of three YouTubers that I watch that do reactions. Um, well, uh, kind of simple again, yet, that, uh, Devin is just an honest, intriguing man, you know, he's, uh, <laughs> like, shit, come on, listen to that laugh. It's the thermal process that fits next to the, you know, put your face between the spread. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy, putting on my spot, I lost his words. And look at those motherfucking muscles. That accept you to see this full, uncut, unedited reaction on my Patreon. Also, check all the links at the bottom of the reaction. So, anyway, man, hope you guys enjoy. I, uh, I stumbled upon Devin and subbed him when he was around uh, 1.2, 1.3 thousand subs. And that was about a year ago. And now Devin has risen to over 60 thousand subscribers. And that is a uh, February 20th, 2022, quite impressive, um, uh, I mean, honestly, Devin, congrats, dude, you are, uh, you, you are one of those who truly deserve it, and if I'm to be honest and blunt, most other reaction YouTubers and their channels, they just don't hold up anymore, but Devin, he's different, sorry to those who are not Devin G., but Devin has come a long way in a short amount of time, and to me that's incredibly impressive. And, uh, I, you know, all the best to him, right? I just want to keep seeing his channel grow because he deserves it. And uh, this shows me the time, persistence, and dedication he has to making his content. He, uh, he knows what the viewers want. He shows his appreciation and gratitude to his viewers every video, and I love that. He adds new uh, new aspects to some of his videos, like he gives a nice Devin G score now. He'll do a score before, and then rescore it afterward. It's really cool, I love that he's adding those little aspects in it. And he's got his girlfriend on the, on the channel now, that's awesome. It's really cool. Devin has this, this realism about him, this charisma. He's got the ability to charm us just by being him. You know, he doesn't really have to do a whole lot to entertain us. And that is just incredible, right? Just being himself, he can be entertaining. It's, uh, it's really wholesome. It really is. And uh, I, I might be speaking for myself, but I think many of uh, Devin's subscribers would agree with me. And from what I can tell, Devin lives a fairly happy, healthy life. True to himself, his family, his friends. And to many other people in his life, I'm sure, uh, he seems like a stand-up guy. And, uh, to that I say kudos, man. Not a lot of people can live consistently, you know. Uh, that might be just military discipline as well, but, uh, regardless of all that, um, as human beings, we can't be expected to perfectly adhere to all principles, morals, and values in life. It's more than appropriate to have a bad day once in a while. Devin seems to hold strong daily, and that to me is what being a very good man is all about, you know? Good man or a good woman. It means you could be a good provider, a good husband or wife, a good father or mother, you know, a good auntie or uncle, good grandma or granddad, it doesn't matter. That's what being good people is founded on, you know, being capable, honorable, uh, respectful, respectable. You're going to be courageous and happy, and those are many key things that Devin is very strong with. And I know this is starting to sound like a love letter, but I just really, really love the guy's content. Okay? Leave me alone. Okay? What are you going to do? Huh? 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 What are you going to do? Devin G has more than earned his spot at the table of YouTuber good guys and good girls. Uh... These are people whom I've categorized as YouTubers who don't sell out, you know, they don't use drama or money or lies to gain views 
you know, boost their ego or get clout or whatever. Devinos also earned his spot to be the first YouTuber to be featured on this brand new series that I am doing to pay tribute to YouTubers all over the platform that are doing their finest and Devin is definitely one of them. So Mr. Devin G, thank you for everything you strive to do and be. You are one of a billion kind of person. I mean that. Stay true. You live happy. And all the best to you, man, really. Truly, I appreciate you too, man. And all the best to the viewers out there. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day. Well, hey there. Dirty Rancher here. I just want to say thanks for watching the video. It really makes my day to see those views go up. So remember, like, subscribe, share, and comment. Have a great day.